Hello and welcome back to day number 79 of my road to 200 kilogram total. Now for today it is a snatch and front squat day and unfortunately for me it was also the strict press day. Ideally whenever I come into these sessions I'm like an hour into a breakfast or after breakfast just so I have enough time and usually before breakfast I'm already I did my cardio but for today since uh I am I was rushing to finish the I mean not rushing I rushed the accessory which is why you'll see that my strict rest is sort of regressing yeah uh, pretty sad about that I was I thought I'd be able to hit 60 kilograms again for at least maybe five but as you'll see later I only hit it for three now the reason why I was sort of rushing was because I was supposed to get the oh here's a pretty funny story I was um, so when I was like really young, like when I didn't even, uh, when you don't, when I didn't really perceive anything, that's how young I was, like maybe two or three years old. My dad's car got stolen, and only years later, like I'm talking, when yeah, twenty plus years, eight, nineteen to twenty plus years later, it was found again, and. So we're getting the clearance to get it back and we're gonna have it fixed up So for today, we're gonna so today I was going to get the car Yeah uh, I think by the time you watch this I were I've already gotten the car and it's already in the shop to be fixed Anyways, so that's the backstory of why I was sort this is a really quick video um, For the snatches I think my mind just went sort of blank like I'm just instinctually doing a lot of the movements now. It's just that automatic to me. And as you can see, I'm not as aggressive or I'm not doing the aggressive foot stomp. I, it's loud, but it's not like how I was doing it yesterday. So I had to sort of get back into the into that mental groove of knowing, of keeping in mind how to lift. So, oh, because I did change my technique. So yeah, I have to keep that in mind. So right after those 50 kilogram warm-ups, I immediately went to 62.5, and you know I'm I'm becoming fairly confident again in bigger jumps in the snatch because I am a better snatcher than I am a clean and jerker, mostly because of just the uh, absolute strength. It's a lot of my a lot of my issues come from just a lack of absolute strength. So here is second set, and as you can notice, my feet really aren't as aggressive like I'm it's good though that I'm planting them right away but it's not like well you'll see in the last set that it's really evident in the last set how I'm doing things that I sort of remember that oh right I'm supposed to be doing it like Gabriel because he is my technical model for he was the he's the assigned technical model that Fitz gave me so I've been studying how he snatches a lot and a lot of it is just ex very good vertical drive and aggressive feet all the way down contrary to uh anton pliesnoy for the clean wherein he would cut the extension short and just pull under really fast right all right let's see this last set there we go very aggressive and i sort of lost balance but again it was it was easy but it was just that lost balance so i think something that would help if you have that problem would be a lot of snatch balances wherein you would really just stomp your feet way out to the side because I do start off with a narrower stance just to get a little more leg recruitment during the pull a little more quad recruitment during the pull and as you can see for the front squats it's just two sets of two at two sets of doubles at 115 kilos I knew I could do it, but because I didn't have that much break in between my cardio session, my breakfast, and uh, my work and the training session, it felt a bit more sluggish, especially considering how 110 last week was just absolutely easy. But then again, this is 5 kilos a bit heavier. And if you put this into a rep max chart, I can definitely do maybe 2. Like, I can grind maybe 2 or 3 more out of this. But So if you put that into a rep max chart, I'm probably at 125 for a single. Now, this is when things really started to hit a low. Uh, again, I'm very disappointed with my upper body strength in general. So I think I have to be doing a lot more presses, a lot more 
yeah basically a lot more presses and as you can hear in the background there's a there's rain yet yeah, it started to rain really really heavily and then it, and it's gonna be evident during the 60 kilo attempt and yeah for 60 kilos I was only able to hit three reps and then for I tried for 62.5 because I was never able to do 65 Yep, there's, there's the volume. I have to put that down. You won't hear it, but yeah, for on my end, I haven't reduced the volume yet. So it's raining pretty hard and it got dark. Anyway, so 62.5, didn't even hit it for a single, but it was closer, a lot closer than 65. But yeah, that's it for today's video. Hope you guys liked it and I'll see you in the next one. See ya.